Hi guys, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. So we are learning about the styling of these components, right? So we have learned the different styling modes that are available in the Angular, that is emulated, shadow DOM and none. And also we have learned about the, diff uh, the difference between these three modes also we have learned. It. In emulated, I want to tell you before exiting this one, I want to tell you some important concept in this emulated one. In this emulated, I told you, right? So shadow DOM doesn't support in all the browsers so it has limited access to the uh, browsers so in order to make this emulated thing the scoped styling concept work so angular has introduced this emulated one emulated one means for every html element it will assign a unique html attribute to each element using that attribute the styles will be uh, generated in the javascript output so in this one for example let's say that if you want to target the if you want to uh, this uh, for example let's say that we have having this profile.component.ts so this is our component now i will take only the element selector only i will remove this one now if you go to our app.component.html now here we are using let's remove this one all yeah this is our main app app iphone profile and if you see the output so this is our output which we are able to see now let's see the inspect element if you are trying to see the inspect element this is the div and for this div, you are able to see the styles has been applied. But what I want to do is I want to apply the styles for this component for this custom element or otherwise component element. I want to apply to this component instance. So how we can apply this one. So for this one, normally you can say that I want to apply. So it is present in the app component HTML, right? So you can say that app component dot CSS. I will try to apply app hyphen profile. Okay. So here you can say app iphone profile and uh, let's say background color of red or anything so just i'm applying this one just to check whether it can uh, able to apply or not now if you try to see here background color has been applied now the one problem is there in this one so what is the problem is for example let's say that this this time we are using an app component html and we have applied to this one so for example let's say that we are using in any other components like uh, any other components like user.component.ts if you have another new component so if you are trying to use it there means then again the css and all those things we need to apply it so this should not happen it like this so for that reason so what we can do is instead of having this one so we can apply directly in our profile.component.css only so this is our component so this component only we are trying to we are we are trying to what i can say css uh, apply the styles so for this reason what you can do is you can apply a host so this is a pseudo selector automatically the element will be applied now for example let's say that for these two i have applied like this so there is no need for div dot lila so only the directly the host element the color will be applied now if you try to see the output for this one see the color while it has been applied but the background color didn't apply to this one here if you try to see for this app profile the background color is there and the color is there but the background color is not getting applied why because by default this is a custom html element right by default the display element for this one will be inline now we need to convert it into display block or anything whichever you want it you can do it so i am converting it to display block now if you try to see here automatically is happen but this time we are able to apply it through the host element so here we are able to apply it through the host element now wherever you are trying to use this variable or, or otherwise not i what i want to say is wherever i am trying to use this component directly these css and all those things will be applied there is no need for us to duplicate this one so this is the use of this host okay the uh, angular supports this host pseudo class and uh, another one which i want to explain you before closing of this one is host context so this is also one of the important thing which i want to explain you host context means what i want to tell you is for example let's say let's go back to this app component html only and here let's say that i am having another view okay app iphone profile i want to have this one so this is our app iphone profile now i want to apply for this one class is equal to uh, um, what i can say is high lila or anything so this component so i want to apply css i want to apply css to only the component which is having a parent of high lila so then how i can convert this one so here we need to use host context okay then which is having dot high lila so which is having an ancestor or the parent of uh, parent of this high lila for those components only it should be applied now if you try to see here only for the second one for the app profile it has been applied why because 
it is having the high lila inside this one which is trying to check it now for the top one the colors and all those things has not been applied why because it doesn't have any class so like this using the host context also if you doesn't if you are if you want to have a conditions in a such a way that only the components which you are trying to use it the, the parent which has a particular class if you want to apply it means so we can use the host context now you are able to understand about this host context and all those things right so this is one thing which i want to explain you and uh, this is these, these are the three things these are the two things which you are needed which you want to understand so another thing is also there which is an ngd for example let's say that uh, these are all the profiles and all those things are there for example let's say that uh, we are having in our uh, profile.component.html profile.component here wait, this one is gone yeah here i am having an another one div class is equal to okay child element i want to apply this one so it's a child element now for this one i need to apply the css now here from where i need to apply the css through the app component.css so from here i want to apply for the child element the color of yellow so now if i try to apply this one here i am unable to apply why because why because so i why i am not able to apply is we know that this is an emulated one so that is the reason i am not able to apply this one so now i am present i am present in another component so i need to apply this child element and emulated one should not be should not be applied so for this reason what we can do is we can use the ng deep okay ng deep okay we can apply like this ng deep now if you try to see the output see here now for this one child element so this one has been removed so angular angular simulated encapsulation supports the custom pseudo class ngd applying this pseudo class to a css role disables the encapsulation for that role effectively turning it on into a global style this angular team strongly discourages new use of this one so now what is the problem for this ngd also for example let's say that we are on the index.html and here we are having a do class is equal to so child element right child element this is the root child so i am using it outside the app root now if you see the output for this one so if i refresh this page so we need to rerun this server again so let's rerun this server so let's rerun this server again so i have rerun this server now if you try to see here the element which we have used outside the app root also the same class it has been applied so for this one what we can do is so one thing so i don't i want i do i want only the child element elements that needs to be applied which are present in the app root then what we can do it is so here in our app component.css here i can use host i can use the combination of host now if you try to see the output for this one see this one has not been applied why because this is outside the host now if you try to see for this hello element now here which is present inside the host then only it will be applied so like this we can refine it we can use the combinations of this one host ngd and all those things but angular team strongly discourages the use of ngd why because uh, it is going to be deprecated it is a deprecated one as a backward com uh, compatibility it is available the api still remain exclusively for backward compatibility only so that's what that's one thing i want to explain you and we have learned about the child element and all those things also now here for example let's say that um, i'll come into this one all now let's go to the profile.component.css or profile.component.html so here also we can implement the style so for example if you want to have a style you can also write the style like this and for this child element i can write the code here dot child element and i can apply the color of red so we can able to see the color of red now this one also will be applied without any problem why because here we are able to see now whatever the styles you are trying to use directly in the html the styles will be encapsulated a unique id 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 html element right that will be applied to these styles also and you can also use like an external links like link these things also will be applied uh, these things also you can use it but uh, that text encapsulation will not be affected for those links but encapsulation will be affected for this link so you will be having a exclusive like this unique id will be applied to this one so these are also overall the styling of this angular thing so hope you understood about this concept referencing of this external style files also i have explained you you can use it like link but the encapsulation will not be affected but whereas using the style tag here like this means the encapsulation will be affected so angular does not support bindings inside of uh, the inside of style elements so that is one thing 
so here if you want to use the binding something like uh, like this if you want to use it means angular does not support it so that is one thing also you need to understand so that's it guys about this one all so hope you understood about the concept so if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you